Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the next session of a test case hub. In this, we are going to discuss how we can use a test case hub and how we can import or export a test cases. Before moving forward, don't forget to like and share the, this video with your friend and please do subscribe for new testers. Camera rolling action. So here we can see uh, test case sub let me going to search test case for a login functionality login and here we can see the number of test cases are available and i am going to filter for all so in one page i can see the all test cases now in real time what happens we are going to write test cases on a jira or a any other tools or excel then we have to write one by one test cases for one functionality it is going to take somewhere around one hour or maybe one day or if it is a complicated functionality then it is going to take more than a day time so in the in that case if we are going to use for a login functionality or let's say whatever functionality we are getting here uh, from test case of those we are going to use then we are going to level, uh, minimize the test case writing time and we just need to here filter it out the test cases what are the test cases are there we just need to skim and scan through the test cases and if it is useful then we can use otherwise we can discard the test cases that is also fine anyways it is a free tool and it is going to definitely help to testers now the thing is if i have a test cases so do i need to copy one by one no so whoever has created the site he has think about all these scenarios and he has provided the uh, various options here so basically if i go down so i can see here there are uh, several options i can copy the test cases i can download in a excel sheet i can download in a csv or i can download as a pdf so we can see if i am going to download as a pdf so test case sheet go download i can see uh, this pdf uh, this test cases are imported as a pdf file and if i am going to download as a csv so we can see csv file has been downloaded xls file has been uh, downloaded so directly in one click we can import all the test cases in uh, various files and apart from let's say we want to copy paste we are writing test cases on an excel sheet and uh, or uh, google sheets and we want to copy paste so just need to we just need to click on the copy button so test case are copied and i am going to uh, google sheets so here what i have to do just i need to paste the test cases so here i can see all the test cases are on my uh, excel sheet and i can directly share with the management team or uh, i can directly start working on the test cases so before that uh, let's do a little modifications it seems some alignment issue little bit here and there so let me just uh, update things uh, voting anyways in real time we are not going to use the vote so i'm going to discard this column and uh, author is also not required here uh, because whoever has submitted uh, it is showing uh, their name so we we are just looking for a test cases uh, positive or negative priority and uh, what yeah what we have to delete and apart from whatever the things we want to add we can simply add here so let's say uh, i need a few more information let's say i am going to so before that let me do some alignment here and i need actual and expected results so before that what i am going to do so I'm just wrapping a text so we can see text wrapping option is here we just need to click and wrap to the next line so uh, instead of going to the next cell it will be in a it will set in a single cell yes so now it looks good now we need a ex, uh, expected result or before that if we are going to write a steps then step to reproduce or perform apart from what we need we need a, apart from we need expected result and what else we need a actual result okay so that's it all the test case sheet has been ready from this side so from this side we have imported the test cases if you are going to write the test cases pretty much uh, here uh, they have listed approx 48 test cases might be some duplicated or we are not going to use so let's say out of 48 we are going to discard let's say 10 or 15 test cases but anyways if we are going to use 30 test cases and then within a minute or within a 30 second we will have a 30 test cases in our seat and what if you are going to work on a login functionality and you have to write a test cases so if you uh, you have a three hours 
time to complete your task you can complete within a minute so that's the beauty about test case hub and uh, if you are if I, i'm not going to use any test cases let's this is not a useful one then i can simply de delete the test cases and number later on anyways it's a easy thing we can update the number anyhow so this is how within a few milliseconds we will have a test cases ready uh, you will get this uh, url from a description you can leverage the benefit i hope this video is useful and thank you so much for your time and before moving forward don't forget to like and share this video with your friend and don't forget to subscribe fundu testers thank you so much stay tuned with the fundu testers